that was about? Well, it is one of my favorite characters yeah, out of good. all the games I've ever played. Yeah. And, um, well, it took some time to pick all the parts together. Yeah. I decided not to bring a weapon because, you know, it's a little bit shady in a public event. Mm -hmm. uh, I'm very happy with the mask. I bought it online. The suit, of course, I bought as well. I'm no pro. But I think it looks great. Very sharp. You look very yes. dapper. The list looks really great. Do you have any last comments? Something you would like to say? Can I swear? Yes, you can! <laughs> Alright. Stand away! Stand away! It's I'm not swear! Scared. <laughs> they just keep fucking coming! <laughs> great! Great! <laughs> I have no problems! Yes. Wow, cool. Okay, so this is amazing stuff. Judges, what do you think about all the costumes so far? Well, the level is insanely high. Mm -hmm. So, um, so this is among the best stuff I've ever seen. Definitely. I've seen it a lot over the years. Mm -hmm. uh, yeah, like stuff like the Monster Chief Armor is why I got into cosplay. Yeah. That's like my dream project. Mm -hmm. and I'm just getting inspired sitting here looking at all this stuff. Mm -hmm, definitely. It's, uh, it's really impressive. Yeah, I've seen some of these costumes and they're definitely on my dream costume list. And seeing them in person is crazy. It's like seeing your favorite character uh, from a video game or an anime just walk out into the real world. Awesome, awesome stuff. Okay, so we obviously have some Halo fans here, right? Halo! Right here, right? Halo! Yeah. Some people. <laughs> yeah, awesome. All right, so we have George from the Halo series. Another big armor cosplay. Yeah. Oh, oh man. man. So rude. Big armor cosplay. Wow. Shit. Yeah, we should have a stage fight with you guys. Yeah. Um, is it going to be possible talking to you? Hey, yes. man. Yeah, hey. Man, you look great. Thanks. Shit. Uh, Do you like to tell us? Uh, yeah, it's basically made out of uh, the same materials that uh, the Master Chief suit is made out of. Yeah. So like foam, craft um, foam, yeah, foam type foam. thing? Yeah. There's foam all the way, except the helmet, which is paper and glass fiber. Scan all here. So what do you tell us? So all of this is foam? Everything is foam, yeah. Whoa, and like, it's amazing because craft foam, uh, those mats aren't expensive either, so this is... No, they're not. Really accessible so, stuff, really yeah. accessible materials, yeah. Indeed. Yeah, yeah. How much time have you used on your costume? Um, I don't really know. <laughs> <I'm>, <laughs> Just on the gun? Uh, no, the gun was uh, used like three days, so that was, that was fairly quick. That was quick? Um, Three yeah. days to make a gun, yeah, no big deal. Good help. <laughs> um, yeah, I guess like a hundred hours at least. Really cool, really cool. Is this whole thing heavy to wear? Because that's what no. I'm wondering when I see all these big yeah, costumes. Yeah, no, it's like, really not. Nice. It's, it's more just, hot than heavy. Yeah, I can imagine. <laughs> yeah. So is it all attached through, I see some belts uh, there as well? Yeah. Over here, please come on up. Let me come for let me come up for something. Whoa! Shit. Fantastic costume, man. <laughs> Thank you. You look great. Uh, tell us, what's the story? The How story? did you start to get interested in making this costume? Well, obviously because I love Mass Effect. I really love playing female Shepard as Paragon because I can, in many ways, relate to her. And I think it's just an amazing experience. So that inspired me to, to cosplay her. So well, you're making me relate to her. Is that you? <laughs> Yes, you do. <laughs> I just wanted to say that your armor pieces look fantastic. What kind of materials are they made out of? Um, this is the exact same material as Ma uh, Master Chief actually oh, okay. used. It is, it is 3D mats. Oh, from Yuga. That seems to be a really popular medium here. It is, it is very simple to use and it's really, really a lot easier than you'd think mm -hmm. and, and very uh, affordable mm -hmm. compared to many other possible options. Mm -hmm. Definitely, and I'm looking, your armor looks great. Um, so, did you do a lot of heating with the craft foam to get yes, the Yes, so much stuff? heating. Yeah, I, I used a heat gun, mm -hmm. not the dangerous plasma thing, but yeah. the, the pretty not dangerous one, and uh, the boobs were really difficult. Yeah. Um, as a 
it's not very easy to dent in uh, craft, uh, not craft foam, but material. Did like you that. just like mold it over something? Yeah, like, I just pressed it over an aluminum ball. Okay. Basically. So uh, for any people who are thinking about making a chess piece, that's how you do it. You just <laughs> yeah. heat some craft foam Just over. contact me and I'll tell you how. <laughs> you know the secrets. Yeah. Awesome. I know the secrets of cosplay. So all, are all of your costume or the armor pieces attached to a cat suit? Or uh, it's not attached to the cat suit. They're mm. all uh, separate parts, which makes it all very, very difficult to put on and off. Mm. Um, and I made everything aside from the boots that I'm wearing under the covers. Mm. The, um, the cat suit mm -hmm. and the, the fabric of the gloves, basically. Uh, tell us about the gun as well. What is our... The gun is, I'm actually going to admit that I, I didn't make it mm -hmm. all by myself. It was a birthday present. Oh, that's so awesome. my blueprints yeah. um, uh, by a New Zealand uh, prop maker mm -hmm. named Andrew Cook. Oh, so shout outs to him. It's gorgeous. Yeah, can you do a little spin for us yes. as well so we can see the back? Very detailed. Wow. Is it all attached through like elastics and um, yeah, elastic bands and stuff? Fantastic, awesome yeah. work. Any last words? Something you would like to say? Yes, that I fight for freedom, not just mine but everyone's, so that people may have the option to choose their destiny. And if I die, then I will die knowing that I did everything I could to stop you. And I will die free. <laughs> okay, cool. So, uh, Dr. Steele is uh, one of my favorite uh, characters. He's an uh, artist, a uh, musician, and uh, got the uh, internet show. So, check it out. Cool. Uh, have you, how long time have you used on costume? Uh, quite the hours. I had to learn how to sue first. Wow, yeah, because you didn't know how to before. But now you do. Now do. <laughs> Very good. Oh, that's amazing. What kind of materials did you make the jacket out of? This is uh, fake leather. Oh, okay. Yeah. So, and uh, oh, yeah. stuff you made raincoats of. Mm -hmm. Oh, this is raincoat material? Yeah. Oh, that's really good. I never would have thought about making gloves out of that. Um, is the leather like stiff at all or hot to wear? It's uh, a bit stiff, but mostly it's just oh, way, way down. Oh, okay. And what about the goggles? You've got like a steampunk yeah, influence are, uh, by there? Yeah, standard uh, steampunk, yeah, to me, right? Mm -hmm. oh, do you like other steampunk stuff? Like, um, do you do you have any other steampunk outfits? Or? I don't, uh, this is my first outfit, but oh, okay. uh, yeah, steampunk. Oh, that's an awesome job. Can you do a little twirl for us as well? Are the buttons made out of that same like raincoat? Uh, the buttons are covered with the same material. Yeah. Oh, okay. And how did you attach those? Did you just sew them on, or glue? Glue. Oh, okay. Hot glue. Hot glue is cosplayer's like best friend, and we're getting some awesome. Yep, she knows. Do you have any other uh, finishing thoughts? What's your favorite uh, part of the costume? No, uh, this is my first uh, time wearing it. So, mm -hmm. uh, yeah, I just basically like to try. Mm -hmm. Awesome job! Thank you very much. <laughs> 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 Have a have um, okay, so as you guys know, at the beginning we had two cosplayers that weren't there. Is the Gary cosplayer here at the moment? Have uh, any of the cosplayers that we have announced out uh, got themselves ready? There's the Garen and the Terra cosplayers from League of Legends. I think they're disconnected. Ooh. Okay, so let's head over to the studio for the thoughts from Amy and Mark.